Gomu Gomu Onmi, is a paramecia type of devil fruit, which turns its user's body into rubber. This devil fruit is wielded by Monkey D. Luffy, who is the captain of the infamous Straw Wat Pirates. He is extremely great at using his devil fruit, and has developed many powerful techniques during his life as a pirate. Today I am going to discuss the powers, that might Luffy unlock, after awakening his devil fruit, and how strong will awakened Gomu Gomu no Mi will make him. But, first let's talk about devil fruits in general. Devil fruits are treasures of the sea, and are very rare to find. The devil fruits grant the wield many abilities, that are impossible to gain otherwise. There are three types of devil fruits in the world of One Piece, which are Paramecia, Loja, and Zone. Paramecia is the most common type of devil fruit, which allows its user, to produce a particular substance, and in rare cases, turn the wielder's body into a substance. Second one, is the Loja class, which are extremely rare and this type of devil fruit, allows the user to turn their entire body into an element, or a force of nature. Zone type of devil fruits, allow the users to turn their body into a particular animal. There are also two more devil fruit subcategories of zone, which are mythical zone and ancient zone. Paramecia also have a category called, special paramecia, a mythical zone allows its user, to turn their body into a mythical beast. The special paramecia type of devil fruit, was recently revealed at Whole Cake Island. So far, there is only one special paramecia type of devil fruit in one piece, and it is extremely powerful. There might be more special paramecia types in One Piece, and the people who wield them are extremely dangerous. During the Dressrosa arc Doflamingo revealed that all devil fruits have another level, which increases their power. This stage was called Awakening. So far, Doflamingo is the only known person who has awakened his devil fruit. His awakening, allows him to turn anything he touches into strings and this was the reason, why Doflamingo was able to fight back against Gear 4 to some extent. I think it is obvious, that Luffy will get his awakening pretty soon, and I think its awakening will be pretty interesting. So, let's talk about that now. As we know, Gomu Gomu no Mi turned Luffy's body into rubber. I think that when Gomu Gomu no Mi is awakened, it might allow Luffy, to change the consistency of rubber. Meaning, his body can act like liquid rubber, just like Katakuri's devil fruit, Mochi Mochi no Mi. In this form, Luffy might be able to create multiple body parts out of rubber, and evade attacks like Akiji, by creating holes in his body. Another property that Luffy's Devil Fruit Awakening might grant him will the power to vulcanize rubber. In this state, Luffy's defensive abilities will become even more powerful. Basically, sharp weapons won't be able to pierce him anymore, and he'll overcome one of us biggest weaknesses. The awakened Gomu Gomu no Mi might also allow him to control his rubber's density. In other words, he can make his rubber body more hard or soft, at will, depending on the situation. Also, if this will be true, With the Awakened Devil Fruit, he doesn't need to use Haki and Gear 4th state, Luffy uses Haki and Gear 4th technique, in order to keep the air in his body, because Luffy will be able to contain air in his body by manipulating the rubber. For example, if Luffy needs to use Gear 4th, he can put air in his muscles, and then harden up his body to contain air. In the future, he might be able to use Gear 4th without Haki, and only coat it on his fists. 
This will make him extremely powerful, and he can stay in gear 4th state for longer time. I think the awakened Gomu Gomu no Mi will become an extremely powerful devil fruit. Of course, this is just a speculation, you would have your own opinion and I would love to hear them in the comment section below. What do you think about the powers of awakened Gomu Gomu no Mi?